So it's my first time using a Chester Sorex. So it's going to be a lot of flops. And I'm very curious because I'm getting ready to prepare something for tonight. And I'm just wondering because everything I bought from, uh, from Whole Foods and I'm buying organic and there is no nitrate or radiation background numbers. So I'm I'm choosing Trot Tester. It's supposed to be pretty easy. Um, I have cabbage, I have onion bulb, so I will start from there. Okay. This is self-explanatory. So I'll wait for a couple of seconds. Take my wonderful <coughs> organic onion. And wait until it measures. Okay, that's nice. That's the first choice and significant excess of standard. Wonderful. Let's try cabbage. Okay, cabbage. I suppose press a K. <clears throat> Um, this is normal, so we're good on cabbage. Let's try potato. They're certified USD organic. I forgot to choose. Potatoes. The only thing is annoying is a noise. Okay. Okay, it's normal. That's a good news. And I have a meat. So we we're choosing meat. Oops, I think I went to oh, it's here. Fresh meat. Okay. I have my fresh 90 fat 95% fat free grass fed beef and I am pressing okay. Oops, I'm sorry, I made a mistake, so we need to start everything over. It's normal, that's good. <laughs> So I'm getting fresh meat, pressing OK. OK. Stick. Now I'm sticking and pressing OK. Insignificant excess of standard. OK, so I have. <laughs> Onion with significant, meat with insignificant, and cabbage normal, potato normal, and I'm just wondering what I'm going to cook tonight. <laughs> so guys, I hope you find this thing useful, and I think I'm going to carry it in my purse all the time, so I know at the store what kind of products to buy, and which ones just keep Okay, bye-bye.